Hello, <clears throat> my name is uh, Ron Pukey and uh, I'm a medical doctor and I've been here a long time uh, on the island uh, uh, since uh, 1974 and I'm also a farmer now as well, something that I adopted early on in my stay here. And I just wanted to talk about the upcoming vote on incorporation uh, and I want to say firmly and clearly that I'm opposed to that. Uh, we have a unique place here. I've been on the island for almost 44 years and I've seen the wonderful traits that drew me here still here because of the uh, rules and regulations and indeed the uh, concern for the, the land base, uh, the environment, the atmosphere of this community that we have such a special place is because of what happened back then when the Islands Trust Act was put into place. I was here at the time and followed by the Agricultural Land Reserve. The two of them together gave us a special place to stay that has preserved itself even though the population's uh, quadrupled since I, I, was, I was here. So um, I want to keep that beauty uh, and in, in the sense that once you've decided to incorporate you can't turn back and the fact that incorporation is built on tax money that's from your property taxes and, and ultimately uh, development is the one way that it can maintain itself. We've got a huge road system that's going to have to be maintained by property taxes. Uh, we have also sorts of wonderful things that have occurred here without the system in place. Um, we have a vibrant community. We've done a lot of special things on the island ourselves, everything from Art Spring, the library, preserving parts of the island like in this valley here uh, with a land conservancy and just citizens like ourselves. We saved a lot of the beauty of this land and we continue to do so. People put their land often in, in wills and in preservation of their land in, in covenants with the systems we have at hand. And I think that that spirit of generosity is much more powerful than a than a, than a system that is going to push us into doing things that we don't want to do and has a variability because there's elections and people change between election and the, and the precedent for municipalities is development and precedent law is also for development as well if it comes to litigation whereas in our case preservation is the rule and uh, those systems have actually stood up pretty well against core challenges to them both the, the trust and the agricultural land reserve so I think we're safer with them. That's what we've had for a long time here. People want to come here now, top 50 places in the world. <laughs> now you see more and more people coming here and saying how marvelous it is. With all those approbations and all the risks involved with making another step, I'd say, let's stay this way. Because there are risks with the corporation and we have such a unique community here uh, that over 43 years, it hasn't really changed for me. Uh, the wonderfulness of the neighbors, the things we do for ourselves, the farming community, the artisans, the talented people, just the people who live in this town and what they've come to expect in, in a small town that is, has managed to escape from the standard municipal processes, which means more and more development. And I just wanted to say that for me, there's no doubt that I'm going to vote positively no against incorporation.